In Bangladesh, rice is our staple food and it's always been a part of our national identity. Now, rice has become a part of our pride too. WFP has helped the government to work together with the private sector to achieve big success with the Rice Fortification Initiative. As a result, Bangladesh can now be very proud of its rice since it now not only satisfies hunger but also contributes to achieving good health and well-being for the population. Let us see how the grains of fortified rice have become grains of pride for Bangladesh. With 60 million people living below the poverty line, many inhabitants of Bangladesh suffer from micronutrient deficiencies, especially children and women. The government of Bangladesh has acknowledged that serious micronutrient deficiencies exist and has included food fortification in the national strategy for prevention and control of micronutrient deficiencies. Bangladesh Sharkar Mohila Shishu Vishak Pantran and Madhome আমাদের যারা দারিদ্র্য সীমার নিচে যারা মানুষ রয়েছেন তাদের জন্য ভিজিডি কার্যক্রম চালু করেছেন এবং এই ভিজিডি যারা পান তাদের মধ্যে আবার অনেকেই খুবই পুষ্টিহীনতায় ভুগেন তাদের যে যাতে করে পুষ্টিহীনতাটাকে রোধ করা যায় সেজন্য 2013 সাল থেকে বাংলাদেশের যে অতি দরিদ্র এলাকা কুড়িগ্রাম এবং সিরাজগঞ্জের দুটি উপজেলা মোট তিনটি উপজেলা পাইলট কার্যক্রম শুরু করা হয় Micronutrient deficiency are highly prevalent in Bangladesh and we feel that addressing micronutrient uh, deficiencies will result in, in positive health outcomes for the general population. And in fact in Bangladesh uh, people consume a lot of rice, this is the staple food. And amongst the, the poorest population uh, we estimate that as much as 80% of the calories that uh, they consume actually come from rice. So that makes rice the, the, the perfect commodity. Uh, to fortify. Fortifying rice with essential vitamins and minerals is one of the most cost-effective ways to ensure good nutrition for all. Moreover, fortified rice tastes and looks exactly the same as normal rice. This has encouraged WFP to bring in their knowledge and expertise in rice fortification. WFP has established a partnership with the government civil society and the private sector to support the people of Bangladesh getting access to rice which is fortified with six essential micronutrients. This rice contributes to reduce micronutrient deficiencies for people who do not yet have the money or the knowledge to ensure the daily intake of a sufficiently varied diet. The support of WFP helps to turn the grains of fortified rice into grains of pride through innovation and effectiveness. The first grain of pride, fighting malnutrition in participants of the Vulnerable Group Development or VGD program. VGD participants are ultra-poor women and their households, heavily at risk of micronutrient deficiencies. WFP introduced fortified rice in the VGD support package and hence in their daily meals. In the program, fortified rice is distributed every month in the presence of the local government. The joint initiative between the WFP and the Government of Bangladesh was started in 2013 and aims to reach its target of 500,000 beneficiaries by 2017. The second grain of pride, collaboration with the garment sector, 84% of the workers in the Bangladeshi garments sector are female. Their work is important to the economy, but malnutrition, which is high among them, hampers them from reaching their full potential. Right. 
To start addressing this, WFP, together with the garment factory, plans to distribute fortified rice to 3,000 female employees and their families to improve their micronutrient status and health with a minimum price. This initiative has already raised interest of other factories to introduce fortified rice to their employees. The third grain of pride, using sustainable local technology. The production of fortified rice needs special equipment. Since importing internationally available blending equipment is costly and time-consuming, WFP has developed a cost-effective, sustainable local solution. There are different methods of uh, rice fortification, but the one that we are promoted is called post-harvest rice fortification. Um, and it consists in blending normal rice with fortified rice. So to get the fortified rice, we get fortified kernels, uh, which are made from rice flour, to which we mix uh, a number of vitamins and micronutrients. And then this is reshaped in the form of a normal rice, rice kernel. And in fact, it is almost impossible to distinguish the fortified kernel from the normal rice kernel. The local technology enables the correct blending of fortified kernel with normal grains. The WFP project team provides technical assistance and additional training to ensure correct blending and quality. আমরা মনে করি যে সরকারের এই যে কার্যক্রমটি যেটি ডব্লিউপি এবং বাংলাদেশ সরকার মিলিতভাবে করছে এবং ডব্লিউপি আমাদেরকে যে সহায়তাগুলো দিচ্ছে যে মিলের মধ্যে যে কিভাবে পুষ্টি চাল এবং আমাদের যে স্বাভাবিক যে চাল আছে তার মধ্যে যে রেশিওটা এটাকে কিভাবে মিশিয়ে করবে সেই বিষয়টিতে আমাদেরকে ডব্লিউপি সহায়তা করছে দ্য ফোর্থ গ্রেইন অফ প্রাইড ক্রিয়েটিং পার্টনারশিপস to make the rice fortification program more successful, WFP is working to build strong public-private relationships with the Government of Bangladesh, DSM, and private sector partners with the sponsorship of the Dutch Embassy. Yeah, the Netherlands Embassy is very pleased to be partner of the Scaling Up Rice Fortification Project in Bangladesh. Um, we partner together with the uh, World Food Programme and with several companies and government, uh, as well as the NGOs. It was very promising that the government uh, came forward with additional funding, with a lot of commitment and with a lot of interest in uh, scaling up rice fortification. WFP organized events at district and upazila levels where high officials from the government ministry BSTI and IPHN made aware and inspired people about fortified rice. Yeah, I think this, this initiative has been actually very uh, successful to date. And the reason why I'm saying this is, is basically it is well accepted and they are really important future uh, prospects. WFP also aims to develop its key partnership with private sector companies that are interested in increased production of fortified rice. This is just the beginning. WFP will continue their technical support to the government and other stakeholders until fortified rice has reached every household in need. This will contribute to the goal of a proud, healthy and happy population of Bangladesh.